Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, you are watching Off the Track, and it is time to drop the hammer. Yeah, Houston seems yeah. like a blast. Uh, now talking about some of your career highlights, the one that stuck out that we uh, mentioned in the intro is you do have a World of Outlaws win to your name, and that's just got to be crazy. I think for most wing 410 sprint car drivers, that's the ultimate goal, whether it's at a home track, whether it's at anywhere, it doesn't matter. Uh, to beat the Outlaws, you know, you have to be the best that night. Can you talk about that win, which was on uh, June 25th in 2016 at Beaver Dam? Yeah, I think... Um trying to think the night before I think the night before was at Jackson, Minnesota and I think I spun out in the dash or something. I screwed up in the dash or I I don't know, but pretty dejected um going into that Beaver Dam race. I thought, well, I just need to, you know, you got to just pick up, you know, pick up and go, you know, yeah. and just put the thing back together and just do the best you can and we just happened to, you know, things were just going really good. I mean, we just I had a really good engine at that time and um, ended up qualifying, you know, just in the right spot, you know, and winning the heat, I think, or running second in the heat or whatever, getting in the yeah, dash. Making you know? the dash is key. Yeah, it was just, that was it. And then it was, it, and it, I think it was the year before I led most of the race and I ended up like ninth or something. I mean, I, I think I, I led like 75% of the, the race and uh, on a restart, I just got freight trained. So I was, you know, trying to fix, fix those things, yeah, you know, as you mistakes. go. And it's, yeah, it's just, it's hard to do it. Sometimes it's hard to pinpoint it for me, but yeah, it was just an awesome night. You know, it was just, and, and you want to do it again. You know, I mean, I want to do it again. I think I've had a couple of good runs since then, but not uh, competing for the win. So it's something it's hard and it's getting harder, I think. Um, so, um, and, and just the way, the way it is with the engines and the, the qualifying, you know, it's like you said, you just got to somehow you got to qualify in that top six or eight and, and it's just tough to do. But, um, yeah, that won't be one that I'm going to forget anytime soon. 